Hey guys, it's G Martin coming back at you with another video. In this one, we're going to be talking about three reasons why you need to buy a drone within the near future. Reason number one, no drone zones are popping up everywhere I look. Now you're probably asking, what is a no drone zone? It's kind of in the name. Pretty much this is an area where if they post it, you're not allowed to fly within that restricted area. Or if you do, you could get a fine or you could get in trouble. Now that is for a good reason though but I think they're putting them in spots where they should not be. If you have a drone, you've probably went to a local park and flown it around for a little bit. All of us enjoy doing this, I enjoy it myself, but picture you go there one day and there's just a no drone zone sign posted and it says you'll be fined a bunch of money if you fly here. How's that gonna make you feel? Probably not very good. That is what a no drone zone is, that's what it does. They're being put up everywhere. I don't think this is such a good idea. Reason number two, prices. The price of drones have decreased dramatically in the past few years. For example, look at mine. I have a DJI Spark and when I purchased it with the drone in the remote, it was around $500. Now you can get both together for $400. This is a great deal. Drones nowadays are moving towards having a smaller footprint, better internals, meaning a better camera, better battery life, and a lower price. There are many drones you can buy today that cost less than $1,000. For starters, you have the DJI Spark, the DJI Mavic, uh, Phantom 3 Advanced, Phantom 4 Basic, those are only like $800. The Mavic Air, Mavic Pro, I mean, I could go on and on. There's a bunch of different brands you can look into. I will have quite a few of these linked down below if you're interested. Please feel free to check them out, especially if you're considering purchasing one. But that's gonna wrap up tip number two. Let's jump right into tip number three. All right, reason number three, drone restrictions. A while back, I saw an article talking about how when drones come out within the next few years, they're gonna come with an internal tag, which is gonna act like a license plate. Before you fly your drone, you're gonna have to set this up with an account linked directly to you, meaning anybody can identify that drone and know whose it is. It actually sounds like a good safety feature to have on the drone, that way it's pretty much you know whose drone it is and you won't get it mixed up, or say you do get into bad trouble. That is reasonable, I could see why that should be there. But now we're gonna talk about a situation where this would not be okay. Let's say you were flying your drone over like a lake or something where you really enjoyed the scenery, you thought it looked cool, thought you could get a few cool shots up in the air, but you happen to creep in a no fly zone and someone sees you. Say they take a photo of your drone, or say the police see it, and they somehow get a photo of that ID tag, they'll link it back to you, and then one week later, you look in your mailbox and there it is, a $300 fine because you creeped into this no fly zone, and if you don't pay it, they'll confiscate your drone or something. Nobody would want to see this, nobody. Drone owners or non-drone owners, think about this for a second. That would really be horrible. That would be a huge just, disappointment and you would not like to drone anymore honestly that would this would kind of play in to help kill off this industry which is not what we want i see a future where drones are used for delivery services they're used for personal needs they're used for commercial needs i could see drones being a regular part of our everyday life in the next few years okay guys thanks for checking out this video i really hope you like it i hope you learned something from it i just want to say this again i will have all those drones linked down below if you're curious please check them out consider buying one before it's too late and then i also have a giveaway going for some dgs work nd filters there's not much you have to do click the link below it'll run you through a few steps and within the next few weeks you'll find out if you won but anyways i'm g martin thanks for checking out this video i'll catch you in the next one peace